only in America. Hamburgers, cheeseburgers, bacon cheeseburgers, chili cheeseburgers, bacon chili cheeseburgers, <laughs> stacking everything on top of everything. It's a sickness. <laughs> This story centers around a Nigerian immigrant who heads to America to be educated in economics. And in his attempt to fit into the world here, he falls in love with the cowboy cultures of Oklahoma. This is a wonderful place. Thank you. A Nigerian guy who is slowly becoming a cowboy. What interest does he have in that? But being here, you experience things that remind you of back home in so many different ways. This character watched a lot of westerns growing up with his dad. So when he came, that was his first attraction. Whoa, 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 give me a hand. It's good. For me, it was about getting it culturally correct to make sure Oklahomans are Oklahomans and to make sure the Nigerians are Nigerians. And it's quite complex because Nigerian culture wears its heart on its sleeve. And sometimes in American culture, it kind of rubs people up the wrong way. To refresh your memory, I'm the best in class. You're also extremely pushy. How am I pushy? <laughs> No, I think people perhaps are more forthright in Nigeria. I love the message of this show, being open-minded and open-hearted to new people and new experiences, but does it in a very character-driven, subtle way. There's an innocence to the way these stories are done that just took my breath away. <laughs> Kinu olu mwehi, 